Okay, hi. That was too awkward. Hey, I am in my mom's car. I'm going to show you my projects that I did freshman year. So our first assignment was a self-portrait gridded. It's not the best, okay? So we've got this. Oh, it's bent like most of these. So back to this. Here's my self-portrait. This was made August 20th, 2021, and it took me seven days to complete. I think next is, I'm not sure if this was next, but anyway, we had to do this, like copy it on around. I just did whatever I wanted to. I did the super S, a skater and some fire. Oh, and I think cows in the corner. So that's that one. Then, oh, this one was much earlier on. This, yeah, this was October 1st to October 12th. Um, we had to do half picture, half drawing. And so I used this picture of my eye that I have and drew half of it. I didn't put enough uh, darks down. I think at the beginning of the year, I was more scared of having too much contrast or putting down dark colors. Now I'm much more comfortable with that, but here it is in its glory, my eyeball. I'm pretty sure next was this one, which is one of my favorites. Dia de los Muertos, um, that was the topic for the assignment. So I did color pencil, um, it's a skeleton, I, I think you can tell from this. Here's like up close, there are the flowers. Um, I started this on October 15th, 2021, and I finished it on October 30th. So that's lovely. This, I copied it from an art I saw online. Like I looked up Dia de los Muertos art and this is one of them that I found, and so I drew it. So it's not my original piece, but there it is. Color pencil. Um, first time using color pencil, and it took a while, but like I like how it turned out. Um, then we have this piece, which was December 5th to January 25th. Yeah, so that took me <laughs> a good bit, but that was because we had Christmas break, or winter break. We had to do like a song lyric or a drawing based off a song. And so I chose Smiling at the Ground by Quedeca. Just drew this. The facial proportions are a little inaccurate, but here. I hate drawing hair, so I kind of like half-assed it around here. But you know, there it is. Earbuds in listening to Quedeca, of course. And... That's all I have to say about that one. We've got my op art, doesn't have a date on it, but optical illusion. Um, I did like, looked up op art cause I wasn't that interested cause I like drawing realism. So I did the circle in the background and then I was like, I should add something else. So I took a reference picture with my basketball and like put my hand on top and I drew it, uh, hatching, yeah. 21, can you do something for me? Oh, I forgot about this one, this one was earlier on. Yeah, uh, September 16th to September 26th. This was our Zentangles project. Um, I did a shark in a bathtub, and then I did a little newspaper that he's reading. It says, breaking news, shark ghost vanished into thin air. Come see Madame Cardi, she sees the future. Cardi as in like cartilage, cause that's what sharks are made of. And then you flip it and it says, criminal swim shady found guilty. It was really punny, I'm sorry. That's that. Again, I prefer realism, so I wasn't too thrilled with that one, but it's whatever. And then, 
I'm gonna say that one for a little later. We have I never finished this one. This was one this one was from February 16th, 2022. Um we had to make a Disney cartoon into realism. So I chose Mulan. I don't know who the artist I got it from was, but I think I found it on Pinterest. And I just did not end up finishing it. I should have. But here it is. We've got Mulan. We've got Mushu. Yeah. We have my prized possession. Um, I think this was for a figure drawing project. I love it so much. It doesn't have a date on it, but... Who cares? I remember this took me so long to do it because I took like a couple months hiatus on it. I was like, I don't feel like doing so much detail work, like especially back here. Yeah, so here's my skater. Um, I love him so much. It, there was like a photo from a skate competition that I saw. So I decided to draw it. Um, the hand up here is too small and like not detailed but you can see the background and the skateboard all the pants and then this head. so yeah i really like it it's my favorite my art teacher mr c has it hung up on his wall so uh that's why this video is taking me so long because i had to like ask to take it home but, uh, finally did that. I meant to film this at Golden Hour, but yesterday, um, after school, I was a little bit tired, and so just did not end up doing that. And then today, I'm going to see Black Panther, so. Yeah, and then, oh, I like this one a lot. This one is white charcoal and black paper. Um, doesn't have a date either. First time doing charcoal, I really ended up I really ended up liking it. I like how it pops. Um, it's a guy. We just had to look up a uh, hyper detailed or hyper contrast something photo references. And so I chose this one and drew him. It's kind of like weird with this shirt here, how it just fades, but like the picture was just kind of like that. I don't know. Here he is. Oh, and then, um, so I half-assed like two of these. We had to do like a perspective drawing. So I just, oh, this is really bad. <laughs> this is not great. But here's that. This is basically just like a little sketch and he was like, sure, you can, you can have a hundred, whatever. Um, the only thing I like is that I added graffiti to it that says Aaron Go Bra, which is Ireland to the end of time in Gaelic. And then there's a little dog down here pissing on a tree. So, yeah, that's about it. Oh, and then I did the Irish flag right there. But, you know, definitely not my best work. I think I might throw it away. And then we had to do a collage. And... The thing was, I'm not too great at that. And here it is. It's a Pinterest picture. It's like some lady to per perspective thing. Foreshortening. Her face got super messed up because I just like couldn't. I think I just wasn't trying towards the end of the year, which I definitely do not plan on doing again this year. Like I'm really trying to be more creative and like, put a lot of effort in with my art. I want all my pieces to be like the skater. But here's this, and the green background, I asked my art teacher, Mr. C, I was like, hey, what color should I do for the background? I'm thinking like white or like some, like a pink maybe, like a neutral color. And he was like, I think you should do green. Cause you know, it really contrast with the warm tones. And I'm like, green, green you say. I'm like, sure, I'll go for it. I do not like it, but uh, there it is. Oh, here's the date. It was finished on April 12th. Don't have a start date. 
And then my last piece of the year, I decided to paint it. I had painted once before, so I'm not like that skilled at painting, but I was like, I want to do this as a painting because color pencils take a long time. I need to try new things and I can't do it in graphite because I this has to do with color. So I think it was like, oh yeah, yeah the topic was, or the prompt or whatever, the assignment, it was self-portrait. So here it is. I should have graded it out or I should have actually done it on canvas. I did it on paper, which is why it's kind of wrinkly. So it doesn't quite look like me, I don't think. I'm not sure. So here's me just like gray rocking. It's the gray. And then I've got like someone whispering in my ear. Well, they're both me. Like me whispering in my ear and then I'm yelling at myself. Doesn't have enough contrast, especially here. But, and then I decided to add these strings around, um, which I like that, cause I didn't want it to be like boring. Tried to add, you know, a little oomph as the last project of the year. And then I put it on a, like, I'm not sure what this is. It's some board. Yeah, that's the last piece I did last year. And then, of course, I did a bunch of drawings in my sketchbook. I have another sketchbook that I finished. Um, and I think that'll be the next video, a tour of that. Which, the art is, like, much better. I try to make better spreads. So, yeah, look out for that. Those are my projects from this year. So, I took drawing one last year as a freshman. And then, I'm a sophomore this year. And I'm taking drawing three honors. Honestly... I think my art has improved. I'm trying harder. I'm trying hard to be more creative. I'm really inspired by Camilla. She has a YouTube channel. I think it's called like Chameleon. She makes great art. She's won like the golden key a couple times for like a couple pieces, I think. Uh, she's done AP art. Like I think she's doing it twice. So I just want to be like her. I want to be more creative, take better pictures like reference photos and definitely try harder and like push myself with my art this year wish me luck and i will be doing that sketchbook tour soon i'm planning on doing videos every sunday actually no i'm not because i don't have that much content to film i feel like Just new videos whenever, yeah, new videos whenever. Ooh! Um, I, you can follow me on TikTok. I'm definitely more active there, like my art TikTok. It's the Hip Hippo. Ooh! The Hip Hippo. Um, yeah, check that out. Thank you for watching. It means a lot. Um, I don't think people would like, like my art, especially because... This is my older stuff. I'm trying to get better. So just, I'm documenting my progress. Um, thank you so much. Yeah, I don't think I have anything to say. Okay. Um, bye. Bye.